So one of the reasons why you were brought out here was because, um, well, as I mentioned before, I saw a loved one's concert without you. And the second I saw, the second by the second song I started texting you, and I'm like, it's missing something. And that element, man, you brought so much to the table on that album. I was like, you know what? We need you to bring something to the table on this. That and was, so yeah. I was working with a friend the other day. I was going through some lyrical ideas. And one of the ideas was just the simple word devotion. And not like a moment of the day, but like wholehearted devotion. And so yeah. I had this little hook, real simple, doesn't even rhyme. But I had it you in mind, and that's why you're here, and you're about ready to sing it. Salute. Don't mess it up. Yes, sir. <laughs> here we go. <laughs> well, gosh. <clears throat> devotion, devotion, yeah. I bring to you all my devotion, Lord. Devotion, devotion, yeah. I bring to you all my devotion, God. What's your name? My name is Dillavu. No, I didn't like that take. All right, hey, crikey, let's go again. Whoa, 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 hey, deeper than the ocean, yeah. That's how his love runs for me, wider than creation, yeah. And far it stretches eternally, it doesn't take emotion, no. The walk with him faithfully, but I love our devotion, yeah. It's what he requires of me. Awesome. Perhaps. Hey, what does this what does this verse mean to you? Um, what it what does it mean to mm -hmm. me? Yeah. Well, it means that there are requirements of being a disciple that aren't based on fickle feelings and made up human definitions of things. Right? So our devotion to him isn't based on how he makes me feel. Mm. Some ethereal realm. Yeah. But it's real discipleship. And it hurts sometimes, but we still give uh, him our devotion. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Feelings aren't wrong. You just, if you base your faith on your feelings, you're going to yeah. have a faith that goes up and down. Sure, because our feelings and emotions are often based on how we perceive the environment that changes around us. But mm -hmm. we don't always have the blessing of seeing the bigger picture of what God's will is. So Nice. Yes, I am. Let's do another take. Two, three. When I'm in his presence, his spirit's in me. The love of my Savior flowing from me. I reach in I love straight from creation. I reach in I love is a higher meditation. I reach in I love straight from the start. I reach in I love from the bottom of his heart. Hola, 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 hola. That was I, I like that a lot. What I like, what I I like the way you kind of tempered it, but didn't didn't hold back. You were unrestrained. But at the same time, what I want now is in some of those gaps. I, I heard you doing a little. Hey, you were kind of yeah. doing. A, I want the hey oh all that stuff that is dilly. I need okay. that. I need you to fill in those blanks here and there. Not overdoing it, but I want you to definitely put in some personality on that okay. one. <clears throat> <clears throat> Well, it's a matter of the heart, hey, for God is love and love is of God, ooh, some people know not what they've got, oh no, if you know not love, 
then you know not God. And if you know not God, then you know not love. Hey, hey, hey you wanted to do that, I and you need to, to do, do that. You need to do that. <laughs> That's what I need. I, you're still kind of like, hey, you're still, you're still like, uh, you can see, uh, you know, holding it back now. It's because I don't know. What's One thing is. that only <laughs> the the serious supporters, the pledgers like you guys, will know is that every single take. In between, he does his march. Do your march as you're doing it. Because you're, you, you sing it. Just sing it right now. Sing it. Give, give him an example. Uh, sing it. It's, it's a man. Matter of the heart. And then he just starts doing his march. Spot like he does, yeah. He's marching in between. And here's proof. You watch his feet for this next take. Here we go. <clears throat> Without the almighty. Hey. Well, it's a matter of the heart. For God is love and love is of God. Ooh, some people know not what they've got. Cause if you know not God. Yep. It's all right. Yes, we all make mistakes. <laughs> He's like, get that camera out of my face. <laughs> You're doing a great job, bro. All right. We're going to turn off this and make sure we're recording over here. Okay, cool. So let's do that one more time. And um, this time I'm going to get up in your mug with a camera, so ignore me. Should I move? Um, no, you're fine. And then uh, if you could focus on the hola, 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 oh yeah. I liked okay. how you were doing the oh yeah or something like that. So hola, don't follow hola, the hola, hola, don't follow hola, the oh yeah. No, ignore that. You just you just all over the place, man. Okay. Just you just having fun. You just you let you just blowing off some steam after doing the chorus. Okay. okay. So here we go, and I'm gonna get up in your grill. <clears throat> Original love, straight from creation. Original love, it's a higher meditation. Original love, right from the start. Original love, from the bottom of his heart. Original love, straight from creation. Original love, it's a higher meditation. Original love, right from the start. Original love, from the bottom of his heart. Oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, yes, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, Holy Spirit, indwell it in me, oh, you <laughs> oh, missed that, man. yeah, man, let's get that oh Lord, oh Lord part, that was nice, though, man, you're a lion, dude, <laughs> man, a lion, mm, missed it, <laughs> all right, here we go. Straight from creation, original love, it's a higher meditation, original love. Straight from the start, original love, from the bottom of his heart. Oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh yeah. Ooh, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh yes, you are. Yeah. Some boy call it love, but lust is what they mean, gratifying the flesh, satisfying the greed's emptiness is a seed. And that produce rootless trees. Them got the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes. No matter how them do, them never satisfied for your life is empty. Without the Almighty. Hey! Yeah, that was nice. Oh. In the studio today with a good friend, Dilavu, and Dilavu number two hiding. That's Jen. She's hiding. Here we go. Jennifer Howland. You know her. Hey, you ready? When I mean his presence, his spirit's in me. It's flowing from me. And this song is called Original Love. Dude, come over here. Jump in the camera and tell me what you think about this track so far. Original Love, what does Original Love mean to you? Original Love is the love that comes from God which existed before the foundation of the world. It's the true definition of agape love. It's the true definition that has been so loosely interpreted by our society in our pathetic culture at this time. So remember what the true original love is. Check that, why? <laughs> 
Now, you, I mean, you may know him <clears throat> from The Loved Ones, so I thought, you know, who would be better than to have someone from The Loved Ones, Dilavu, a good friend of mine, who actually was on the title track, Roots Revival, Roots Revival, um, on the last album, so I uh, brought him and his lovely wife, Jen, who used to sing with us, you may recall, um, down here to do this. And, you know, I want to talk to you about love for a second. The world calls it love, but in many cases what they mean is, is lust, and, uh, or just satisfying their flesh, and their life is empty, and without Christ, you don't have true love. If you know not God, you know not love. If you know not love, you know not God. I reach and I love. We're tracking today. Original love, straight from creation. Original love. All right, God bless. Raga, raga, raga. <laughs> so one of my favorite things in the studio is the creating process. It's like, it's like when you're a sculptor and you just start, and then you finally have like the form of the statue, and it's just awesome. And then my least favorite thing is the polishing and the perfecting, and you know, making it flawless. So right now we're in the creating process, and so that's one of the reasons why I brought this guy. You know, the word music actually comes from muse, and. Um, in, back in the days, poets and, and songwriters would use a muse, which is usually a person, to inspire. We use things like God's Word, um, locations. We like to go into different places. Uh, for Avion's album, we use... There it is. He's showing the Bible. For Avion's album, we used the muse of Hilo, Hawaii. But another thing that you can use is... The muse of a human being that inspires you. This guy inspires me right here, Dilla Vu. And so uh, we're writing, we're kind of splitting a chat verse. And so I'm about ready to do my part. Let's see if I can do it. Here we go. Whether it's good or bad, I'm going to roll it. Because I'm going to show you how it really is. Why love it is my weapon, so don't step on, we praise the Father from heaven, a with the power of sound. Love it is my weapon, so don't step on, we praise the Father from heaven, feel his presence all around. While it was death by love, when love was crucified, so cast away the fear and doubt.